Assalamu alaikum everyone. This is my overnight's oat uh, recipe. These are all the ingredients that I use in them. I try to stick to as organic as I can. Um, I get my oatmeal from Amazon, so it's also gluten free for those of you guys who avoid gluten. I just buy a bunch of packs from Amazon at a time, but you can get them from Superstore. Try to get the organic. These are chia seeds that I can also get from Amazon or Superstore or Costco. I usually just eyeball everything, but you can never have enough chia. This is some hemp seeds that I also add to my oatmeal. These are both really high in protein and omegas and lots of good stuff. Flaxseed. I love flaxseed. It's super good for you, but the taste is not very good so I don't put as much of that as I do everything else and this here is a little camu camu which is really high in vitamin C it's just this berry from South America and it's just grinded down into a powder which is also bought from Amazon mix it up before you add your milk because especially the chia seeds it's hard to mix around once they get wet with the wet ingredients When everything's all evenly mixed, you can add your maple syrup. I wouldn't do any more than two tablespoons for a big bowl. Um, I only add it because my kids won't eat it without sweetener. But um, yeah, just mix it all up in there because once it's set, it will not mix that well. Um, I like to cover it up and put it in the fridge either in the morning if I need it in the afternoon or at night so I can use it the next morning. This is what it looks like, it's quite watered down, but the next morning it absorbs all of that. So if you like it like that, that's great, but if you like it a little bit more watered down, you can just add some more milk afterwards, or you can just initially start off with a lot more milk. I'm wearing my jacket here, so as you can see I'm on my way out. So sometimes I'll put this in a container to take with me to go, or in this case, I put it in a bowl so that I can try to feed them before we leave so they're not too hungry and they're full of something that's nutritionally dense and as well as really filling. To make things even tastier or more fancy, I add some fruits on the top sometimes. I use some mango or organic blueberries. I love frozen fruits. My priority, however, is to use up any fresh fruit that we have, like this mango or uh, this peach that I have here. You want to use them before they go completely bad. I sometimes just make the oatmeal directly in these little mason jars for my kids to have for breakfast, and they just eat out of it by themselves, or these larger ones for my husband and I. And sometimes I just put it in a container so we can figure out what we want to do with it the next day. This is the final product with some overnight oats with some frozen blueberries on top. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and assalamu alaikum, take care.